Okay, I think it's not long. I think it's gonna start now. That tiny moment of anticipation before the next song. Let me try. But it's all the time we need. We've already studied every note, every beat, to bring you this song, your song, right here. Is it same online? Okay. Oh wow, everything's working now. Hi. Uh okay. <laughs> uh welcome to the first night of Sleepy is Rain. Oh, ooh. I left something open. Hold on just a second. Okay, um, can everyone hear me okay? Yeah, there's a bit of a delay, but I can hear you. Okay, alright, and, and everything is live? Everything is live, everything is good? Okay, okay, wow, okay! <laughs> uh, I, I guess let's just, let's just get started then. New game. About to pimp your shit. Okay, so we are playing uh, <laughs> this, The Sims 4. Um, I am Pokeladouts, and this is Sleepy is Meringue. Probably already said that. Sorry, I'm a little nervous. Um, especially since we're late. Uh, let's see. Let's just go ahead and play with one of my pre maids. No. Stop showing off things. Hopefully I don't have anything I've forgotten about. You know, I really like this sim. I made her recently as a recreation of a Sims 2 sim. So I think... I think we're gonna play as her. And yeah. Nice little, little lady here. Uh, her personality and all that are based on her... Uh, Sims do counterpart. So I think. I think oh. we're. Oh, yes, yes, you do speak. Ambuya asking not. <laughs> yeah, so I think we're just gonna. We're just gonna get started. Yeah. Okay. And I like to add a little. To make sure that I don't get confused in the gallery. Hmm. Okay. So normally I kind of like Oasis Springs better, and you know, she actually is from a desert college in The Sims too. so I think, I think we will go with Oasis Springs. So now of course we've got to pick out a nice little place for her to live. Um, hmm. So kind of a little bit of a warning. Uh, not everyone is big on the use of cheats in games, but, you know, the whole money thing and totally earning it out was never really part of my playstyle once I found out about those cheats. So, um, we're gonna go ahead and spam her with funds, which she will earn, and, uh, oh, yes. We are here. But we want something that looks even more deserty, so we're probably gonna go somewhere else. For those of you not in the know. Okay, that probably seems like a lot of money. Um, but, you know, that's, that's just my playstyle, so. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and move you now. <clears throat> and move you to that nice house by 
the Calientes. Um, yeah, so, uh, I've been a big fan of The Sims since about middle school. Middle school? Yeah, middle school. I uh, started with Sims 2, then Sims 3, and i uh, really been enjoying Sims 4 so far as well. Uh, she doesn't really need anything fancy, but I want her... Hmm. I know this place is nice. Let's try this one. Yeah, furnished of course. Because I did not set up a house for her before we started. Uh, everything has been kind of on the fly. Um, hopefully that doesn't screw me up at all. Um, and um, yeah, so I have, I have my own personal playstyle. I do tend to kind of pause and then speed up and pause. I, I do tend to micromanage them. Uh, hopefully I won't be doing that as much as usual. Um, you know? So basically the goal for The Sims 4 series in particular is going to be... Oh well, yes, you do enjoy doctor shows. And you know, I am going to take that as a sign. I was debating on having her be a scientist or a doctor. And oh, okay. You want to do push-ups now. I get that. You are an athletic sim. Um, hmm. Mm, now I am conflicted though. Scientist or doctor? Uh, well, let's just let her get used to the neighborhood first. We'll just let her play around a bit. Why are you flirty? I'm so confused. Oh, watched romantic comedy. Of course you did. Let's look at your needs. Having fun. What kind of skills do I want you to specialize in? Again, everything is on the fly. I had some ideas of stuff to uh, uh, do beforehand, and I ended up not doing any of them, so I apologize if there are times when I'm just kind of like, I don't know what I'm saying. Um, but hopefully no one will be too uh, offended by that by my laziness. She seems to be having fun anyway, so... Are there no bookshelves in this house? No, there's one right there. Of course there is. There's just books. Well, let's see. In the original game, she is... Uh, well, from Sims 2, rather. She happens to be an alien who came to college. Ooh, I don't remember... Hmm. I do not remember her major... Mm, that would have definitely impacted my interpretation of her, but there are certain skills I like my sims to have, like baking and cooking, charisma, like it just is useful down down the road. Uh, comedy, I haven't played with the comedy sim yet, but she's going to be some kind of doctor or scientist thing, so. Fishing, she does want to explore our world. Uh, should probably do fitness on her own, I don't think. Oh. Just in case. Just in case. Uh, gardening. Gourmet food. Uh, what kind of instrument does she want to play? Maybe, maybe she doesn't like earth instruments. Maybe, maybe that's a bit much for her. It makes her too homesick much music. I don't know. <laughs> um, she is an earthly explorer. Mm, I'm probably gonna use logic. Uh, no mischief, please. Uh, mixology. Eh. Painting. Painting sounds like it's upper alley. Um, yeah, so her art will be painting. And, uh, what good science? Might need that. Might just need that. Video games, violin, writing. Uh, yeah, rocket science. I mean, she is an alien. She got here somehow. 
Um, so yeah, I'm gonna do an up to down here. So oh, I'm just so torn because I've already played through the doctor one a little bit, and I'm not quite sure if it's upper alley or not. Um, hmm. But you know what? I think I'm gonna go with scientist. Yeah, I'm gonna go with scientist. Um, if I can find a desk, I will put down a computer and she'll be a scientist. Oh, there's one right there. A little weird, that's like a kid's room though. Um, well, eventually she will have kids apparently. Uh, do, 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 find a job. You, Miss Toronto, are going to be a scientist. Social event. Oh, well, you have guests, don't you? No? Okay. A little confused now. Oh, what if she's a detective, though? So many. Ooh, scientist is cool, but. Yeah, I really didn't think this through ahead of time. Sorry about that. Um. Hmm. I would ask the audience, but I actually do not have a tab open with the chat. So I am going to Hey, hey John. John. Oh no. Oh no, there's a delay. Uh my fiance John is here. Um okay, there we go. Hi. Uh, do you think my sim should be a detective, a scientist, or a doctor? Let's go detective. Detective, okay. Alright. Sorry, I was listening to your broadcast. Make sure everything was okay. <laughs> it's also really delayed, so I didn't know you were already talking about it. <laughs> okay. Let's set my mic there. Okay, so, yeah. Detective it is. Whatever. Someday we will have more professions in The Sims. They're really fun, actually. Yeah, yeah, she's a detective. She's inspecting the earth. I miss my makeovers for my townies. But that's my personal save, and not the one I have here. Like, yeah, yeah, you just, just swag over here, Don Lothario. Okay, so... Deal mood focus. What skills does she need exactly? Sometimes uh -huh. we get a little confused by that. Hmm. Nerd brain. I already forgot what the requirements were for this one. Um. Yeah. And when is your next or first work day? Is tomorrow. Oh. Oh no! I've already made enemies with the neighbors. Um, if you're a detective, let's get some logic skill. Let's go ahead and do that. Um, let's put a little, I don't know where they have to go to the bath, through the bathroom to get to this bench here. Yeah, you're just giggling it up, aren't you? I really love these balconies, actually. Well, let's go ahead and switch up this bench. Oh. Let's go ahead and switch out this bench for, uh, uh da -da -da. a chess table. There we go. My mind goes places. Uh, skills, chess table. All right, click that. Do -do -do -do. And, uh, that looks nice. Yeah. Also doorways. Do so yeah, in general, I'm gonna try not to be in build or cast too much, cause I can just do that like forever if no one's stopping me. So uh, gonna try to. Oh, those don't match though. Yeah, I I can be kind of 
picky about what things look like. That looks a little better. Um, but I'm gonna try not to do that too much, because I feel like you all are probably here for the gameplay, and not exactly a readiness. That's a good one, too. And become energized. Uh, we'll see. Let's see. Handiness. Let's go ahead and read a handiness book, actually. Yes, I know this is very enthralling information. Just watching my sim read a book. Um, but that gives me time to talk to you all. Now, doesn't it? Um. Yeah, okay. Means I have to find it. Oh no, handiness is in here somewhere. Is this it? No, it's a reversal. Okay, so one of these. As you can tell, I am extremely organized, of course. Okay, so it's gonna look like one of those books. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. Of course I don't. You know what I could be doing with my son here? She could totally be reading at the park. And you know, we're gonna do that. We're gonna go to the park. You better put that back in your inventory. No, no. Put in your inventory. Go into the park just to read that book that one right there and then we're gonna get ready to go to the park you are still flirting yes you are let's go ahead and just get all nice and oh ooh, ooh, geez sorry about that sorry everyone i hope your ears didn't explode um oh why are you talking to dina no just right i didn't tell you to go there yet Telling me travel. You'll meet plenty of townies, and I'm sure they're going to be wearing some very strange things while we are there, because that's what townies do. I've noticed they wear they wear my fantasy CC, and they wear it very strangely. Um, yeah, let's go to the park. Let's go sit on a bench, enjoy the nature, you know, just, just internalize everything and just, just enjoy life. And all the serene things it has to offer. Ooh, this park is a little different from the one in, oh jeez, what's it called, Magnolia Promenade? That is not it. Willow Creek. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so just have a seat, Stella. You have you have plenty of time to flirt with people that are already taken in my other universes. But today we're going to do some skilling. It'd be funny if they could get sunburned. I think you can in Sims 3. In fact, I know you can in Sims 3. Um, handiness number one. I've never gotten that why the books don't just kind of auto sort in the inventory. Why, why anything doesn't auto sort really? It's kind of frustrating sometimes. So we're just gonna, you know, let her do her thing. Just, just people watch for a little bit. Um, my gameplay style seems to be extremely like just goal oriented. I'm all about building up their skills and their friend- well, more so their skills and their relationships. Um, ooh, that does remind me though, I have had a glitch before where skills would not peak on public lots. I might have to keep an eye on that. Um, there's Katrina. You know, funny thing about Katrina Caliente in The Sims 4 is just to emphasize how much this is like an alternate universe is uh Katrina is not their mother in The Sims 2. Uh their mother is oh I I'm sorry, I don't remember her name. But there is some oh hey. What are you doing? I thought you were reading a book. I hope you didn't lose it. 
And check out still in your inventory. Good. Good, you are pleasing me. Um, you guys are actually playing chess, or...? Uh, guys, go ahead. You need some logic. Why are you being so mean, dog? Okay, now you're getting nice again. What are you doing? I'm so confused. Um... Oh, no, just, just ignore him. Just ignore him. Property values. <laughs> it's kind of a specific thing. Um... Yeah, so... Could... Oh, what? Never disguise. Hey, you are not going to be hiding your alien heritage whatsoever. I didn't know that was a thing. I didn't know aliens didn't like people knowing they were aliens. <laughs> so it's kind of weird to me. Um, just in case anyone's still wondering, so back to the Katrina thing. Um, I kind of like to think that Katrina is a gender swap of their father. Uh, Flamenco, I think is his name. Okay, you're 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 not having fun with these people, like at all. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and uh, who wants lunch? Let's go make some lunch. You don't know how to cook yet, but you're gonna learn. You're gonna learn right now. Let's get away from these awkward, angry people. Hmm. You know, not gonna lie, sometimes I pick food just because it sounds good to me. And sausage and peppers, it is. I'm going to eat that because you are hungry. Oh, your logic skill is so close, but so far away. Oh, poor baby. She's not having fun. Poor, poor baby. Miss Stella. Miss Toronto. Yeah, go ahead and just feed the whole park and I bet no one will say thanks. Because they're prejudice. Against interdimensional beings. Intergalactic? I think they're I think in this game they're they're in a different dimension than aliens. Yeah. See? Feeling better already. Hmm. A cute face. Cute little alien. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hello there. Why oh, are you making friends? I am so proud of you. <laughs> um Yeah. Oh, oh no, are you sad? Were you just crying a second ago? Let's cheer you up. What's your name? Jade and Blue. <laughs> dag dag. Oh. Okay. No one likes aliens in this game, apparently. Are you? Are you even technically in a disguise? Like, now I'm getting kind of paranoid. Oh man, no one likes you. Oh. Whoa, your disguise kind of looks nothing like you. Uh, and your eyes are actually more alien than they were before. So I'm a little confused. Although she probably already knows you're an alien, so I don't know what the point was. Try to calm down. Empathize. Hmm. Why do you smell so bad? Okay, so going to the park was an utter disaster. And I don't like you being in your disguise, honestly. Like, I like you being you, and people are just going to have to tolerate that. I don't care. Let's go home. These people are mean. Whatever. I 
I forgot how to go home. Right, that button right there. I haven't played in like a couple weeks, so I'm oh, still a little like and I've never played with an alien before. Oh this is so sad. Like why is everyone so so mean to her? Sad. Ah. Hmm. Well, we will just tr have to try to make you the prettiest alien you can be. Just gotta... Like, really, who, who couldn't love that face? She's so... She's so friendly. She just, you know, she just wants to live life. Joy life. You know, just enjoy who she is. What you guys got against fun, huh? What do you people have against fun? And aliens. You know, maybe you should just get some sleep. Oh, No, honey, don't hide. Oh no, let's not read your bed. Fortunately, the nicest bed in the game does not have as many nice little patterns that we make do with what we have. And, uh, I remember her liking pink in the original game, like that was part of her bio, I think. Uh, just, just sleep. You know, you, it's not exactly like you're hiding your alienness. I, I don't really get why everyone's so upset. Okay, let's get you a bit five. Do do do, waiting for five a.m. Oh, okay. You you are already up and you're energized. I forgot how cute your pajamas are. They're very adorable. Um, let's go ahead and. Yes, you'll notice I do have them take a lot of bathroom breaks. <laughs> and, uh... Thoughtful? No, it's inspiration. This is energized. I wonder to be focused. Uh... Is there just shower? Oh, whatever. Just take a speedy shower. Nope. Visible to the masses. Oh, hey, you're wearing your winter clothes. Okay, okay, respect that. There are no seasons yet, so makes sense. <laughs> um, yeah, I just, I, when I was originally playing around with her, I made like a bunch of different outfits, and the original one was actually her summer clothes, or spring, I think, and uh, this one is her winter outfit, so... Uh, you're still not really hungry yet, but let's go ahead, serve some breakfast, and I guess the only option right now is scrambled eggs. So, let's just go do that. Hopefully your co-workers will be nicer than Larry. random strangers in the park, and you will make some friends today. And yeah, well, yes, scrambled eggs is a very delicate art, of course. Like, man, you're eating seasonings and spices. It's more than I can do. Let's go ahead and put that in the fridge before we forget about it. Yeah. And then, oh, are you hungry? I don't even know. Let her indulge. She's been having a crappy week. <laughs> That's right, dishwashers exist in the game again. Maybe I should get her one. Well, eventually. Eventually. This again, I'm gonna try not to go into buy, build, or cast too much. And mostly just because I know it'll distract me. <laughs> so. Yeah, you do those crunches. Man, you 
start work in two hours. One hour. I don't know why I said two. Um, is there anything just kind of useful we can do in that time? Oh, chess. Let's never play some chess. Not that video games aren't important. But let's play some things right now. Is that a burglar alert? What is that? Can't click on it. I have no idea what that is. Play. Let's, let's go play chess by yourself. Because I figure I wanted to focus gameplay on individual sims and different career paths. I didn't really want to do too much of the family building in this game. I wanted to focus more on that in Sims 3 and 2. And Sims 4 is all about more career based sims because they have the career options, you know, the go to work options. So I figured that would be kind of the focus. So we're just going to play a little series with each one um, until more features come out for the game. And you know, it's not like there's not already a lot to do. You know, you can be those three and then eventually I also plan on having a business sim. So we're going to see how that turns out. Maybe she'll retire. And, you know, sell poodle statues. You know, I also f I forgot what my settings are. I should probably do that real quick. Mm. Options. Mm. So she should, yeah, she shouldn't be able to age up. That's another thing. I, I like to age them up manually. So, yeah. Okay, I have never been to this area before. I've I've explored being a nurse a couple times, um, but not a detective. So let's see. Let's. I'm, I feel like this is gonna be a lot of fun. Oh. Oh, the cells are already filled with people who've been arrested. <laughs> oh, jeez. Um, and what? How do I get a case assignment? Okay. All right. Thank you. Use computer. These look like they're being used. Is there? Are there more upstairs? Break room, workout room. Typical police fair, of course. I have no idea what this blank space is. Um, I wondered if there actually are, like, if, if it is the intention to eventually uh, upgrade those areas. Hmm. Might have to kick someone off. Are you in a chat room? What are you doing? Get off of there. Yeah, you, you, you go. You go. And everyone's gonna hate us because we're an alien. Of course. Come on. What? Okay, there we go. Uh, this is the crime scene investigation. You need to learn the ropes before you can handle running your own case. You'll start by assisting a veteran detective with a crime scene investigation. Use the crime map to travel to the crime scene. Okay. What is my crime map? Again, I've never done the detective one before, so I'm kind of like, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, where's my crime map? That's, that's what it said, right? Crime map? Travel to crime scene. Go to crime scenes. Oh, okay. Uh, let's try not to waste time. Go to crime. Where's crime map? Is that in my 
my inventory? I I'm sure everyone watching this is screaming at me. You know, the ones who've played this before. <laughs> um, crime map. Oh man, I am, I am not gonna do well with this. <laughs> if I'm already confused. Um, this is the crime map, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Okay, there we go. Uh, earbuds. Yes, I do have a save a new crest. I enjoy it very much. Hmm. I will try that personal brewer. Oh, I like the music. At a crime scene, you can find clues that will help you track down a suspect. Investigate damaged or stolen objects and search for clues on the ground nearby to uncover more evidence. Also, talk with witnesses to get a report about what happened. Okay. Collect clues at crime scene, get a report from a witness, and take crime scene pictures. Okay. Alright. I have no idea where this is. Um, I also don't know what kind of crime this is. Friendly introduction. Let's try to, to schmooze with you a little bit so you're more likely to give us information that we want. I just. Can, can I? Okay, okay, I don't need to. I know the detective career in Sims 3, you kind of had to get them to like you first, so. Mm. Limited amount of time. So very limited. Uh, collect clues. It takes a oh, picture taking. I'm not sure if I'll be particularly good at that. Are these are these damaged? I'm, I'm confused, honestly. <laughs> Computers. Okay, so I guess the computers are the main thing here. Um, let's go ahead and take a sample. Yeah. Cool. It's my inventory. Okay, let's just. I guess let's just. And then. We have to take some pictures. Well, that's kind of weird since they're already, you know, t doing that. I don't entirely get it. No, no, I'm on official business. Oh, well, I, I guess they're just saying hi. Um, no, that's not. There's one other item. At least there should be one other item. Is there another computer upstairs? I mean, I'm kind of confused. <laughs> uh, I was so much better at the nurse career. Just funny since being a nurse is so difficult. Um, I, I don't know that from personal experience. I've just, I've heard things, terrifying, terrifying things. Um, so, where is the fifth, like, clue? Hmm. Dust for prints. Where can I dust for prints? That rug seems suspicious. There we go. Okay. I don't think it actually was, but... Oh, okay. Alright. I don't have to go into camera mode every time. That's nice. I mean, guess if I just click on the ground, it'll probably do that in general. Yeah. 
Okay, okay, I'm getting the hang of this. Don't you worry. You know... Let's keep going. I'm gonna use my magical cop radar to investigate. <laughs> Okay. I see kind of a stain down there. Is it? Yeah, print. Okay. And here. Man, look at all this. It's like, was there like an, an arson here? Like. What is this exactly? Okay. Turn to police station. Ugh, jeez, stop calling her out on her alienness. Please. It's, it's very frustrating. Okay, go back to police station. So, I think I've got this figured out so far. <laughs> um, yeah. Now that you've gathered evidence from the crime scene, it's time to start tracking down the suspect. Use the chemical analyzer and computer to evaluate the evidence you found at the crime scene. There's a chance you'll discover some information about who committed the crime. Okay, chemical analyzer. Try these thingies, I think. Thingies. So technical. Test analyzer. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's try that first, actually. Oh yay, she's happy. I shouldn't be testing it. I mean, she does only have to, like... Ooh, cat showing. Oh, what is going on? Nice work. Analyzing evidence from the crime scene allows you to discover clues about the suspect. Once you're running your own case, you'll have to analyze lots of evidence before you can find the suspect. For now, use a computer to file the crime scene evidence so that the senior detective can take over. Yeah, sure. I mean, you know, whatever. <laughs> uh, evidence sample. Well, let's just do one more, just in case. And then... Sorry, buddy. I need to be using that computer. Well, crime scene evidence. No, it didn't produce any useful results. Man, you guys need to stop chatting at your computers. What kind of police station is this? Okay, go ahead and do your file paperwork stuff. That's a cute touch, the little dossier right there. Dossier? Is that even the right term? Good work. The evidence you found will be helpful to the detective in charge of this case. Once you get your own case, you'll have to follow up on the evidence yourself. Well, that makes sense. Tomorrow you'll learn about the next steps in a case. For now, take some time to help process criminals here at the station. Sure, no, no problem. Just here to help, really, you know, I mean, just, just here to be awesome. Uh, okay, let's get my bearings again. Uh, we will have some overtime, I know that much. Fingerprints, search, and take mugshots. Hmm. Let's take mugshots, let's get that out of the way. I'm, I'm kind of paranoid about the photography for some reason in this game. So let's let's go ahead and do that. Uh take a mugshot. Um Huh. You all look like fantasy characters. 
Her name is Elvis. That's 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 reason enough. That is reason enough. You you could be a zombie. We need to we need to get right on this. Seriously. I mean you are You are just a threat to society. Look at that guy. Look at him. He's ready to make a run for it. Elvis is a zombie. I'm on to you. So on to you. Okay. Well, we got a mug shop. Search suspect. And then... Fingerprint. Oh, whoa, hey, what? Why did that not work? Okay. And then search. I swear if the game like it's too small or something. Oh my god, how come how come I can't search you? I'm so confused. Oh whoa, did you just escape? Like what's going on? The AI here is a little weird. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Finally. Is that a- is that a- what? What was that? I thought that was a heart for a second. Oh jeez, you need to go to the bathroom. In fact, you're- Oh, ew. Found something gross, apparently. Uh, release from cell. Doesn't exactly sound very. Okay, he's putting it back. Good, good. It's not have any escapees on my watch. That would be embarrassing. That would be just. Oh, hey, how come I couldn't do overtime? There was like still time. Oh, because ah, I didn't select it. Jeez. Uh, oh, tomorrow. It's a very intensive job. I'm gonna be doing this every day. Every day. Isn't that right, Stella? Okay. Well, it is now five. And you are hungry. You are a strong, independent woman. And you don't need to start a family if you don't want to. I'm just reassuring her. Let's have a salad. No, don't eat your nasty leftovers. So, yeah. You go ahead and do your thing. Yeah. Let's just enjoy the tossing of the salad. Still awkward turtle. Still so awkward. Um, yeah. Enjoying your salad there, buddy? You are indeed. Hmm. Let's see what you can do for fun while we're not at work. We could have you sit and play video games and have it be really meta, or maybe we gotta do something else. Probably not involving people since everyone kind of hates you for some reason, so let's keep it indoors. Just just for now. Just for now. You know what? I'm gonna build you a rocket ship. I, I don't I don't even care. I don't even care. No, you're you're getting a rocket. I'm just gonna move this there. You might have to delete some of those too. Um, where is a rocket ship? Oh, here we are. Steampunk flying machine. So I can't. No, no, I don't even care. Eventually, you're gonna have to visit your homeworld. So. 
This is what we're doing. What we're doing for fun. At least I, th I think it looks pretty cool, so. I think it's only reasonable that she enjoys it as well. Yeah, you acquire that skill. You just be a rocketeer. I'm not sure if people who pilot rockets are called rocketeers. That that doesn't really sound accurate. <laughs> um, it really doesn't. I don't know what I'm talking about, like, half the time, so it's just, uh, no, and then eventually, you're gonna have to go to bed, Missy. So you get one more hour on the rocket, which did not increase your fun at all, but you seem to be enjoying it, I, I think. It's, it's, yeah, let's let you unwind a little. Uh, yeah, I actually do really enjoy watching the little weird TV shows. Um, cooking channel. How about that? That way you can have fun and improve your skills. Oh, I, I'm not sure if you just were falling asleep or if you just really love the show. I mean, look at this. Look at this. This is amazing. Oh. Are you playing a game while watching... Uh... Bronze... Cook? I'm going to assume that's what it's called, because... Copyright. <laughs> um... Oh, little old lady Cho. I don't know, I actually really do enjoy watching them just cook. It is one of my pastimes in the game. Um, oh jeez, it's just, it's weird because I don't... It's a very calm game. And that's why it's kind of hard to come up with stuff to just ramble on about. Because again, I was planning on having like little note cards and just kind of like topics where it's like if I hit a slow point, I would just, you know, start talking and then I didn't do that and Stella's mad at me because of it. She she knows what I didn't do. She knows. She can read my mind. Because that's what aliens do. Yeah. <laughs> I do not know. Um so as you can see here she is asleep. Let's wake you up now. You need to get some food in you. As well as get you ready for work. Speedy shower. I think she could smell herself. <laughs> oh, the toilet. That's, that's wonderful. Um, don't worry, girl. You'll have a special recipe. No, that'll just increase her. Look at the toast. Yeah, it's, it's whatever. Go with that. Yeah, come to think of it, making eggs on the first day is not super realistic. Eggs do not last that long. Yeah, they really do. Do I have to get you up earlier? How is it already? Seven? So this is just the story of my life. It's like, wow, it's already... And you are on fire. Huh. Yeah, you're... Why, why can't I... What? Yeah. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, there's a sprinkler! I... I... Yeah, there's sprinklers in the... Oh. Yeah, let's, let's just forget that happened. So, some leftovers. You know what you're doing? Yeah, let's, let's just do that. 
Although you literally have to, yeah. Yeah. Wow, that was lucky. I was extremely lucky. <laughs> um, I was not expecting that. I must have forgotten to upgrade their- that's one of the little things I do is I, I like to upgrade the stoves and the fridge right away so that they don't die. <laughs> uh, I don't know, should I keep reading the little- oh, I guess I should. Uh, training day two. Train harder. <laughs> Oh, that's a great reference. Uh, there's still a bit more to learn before you'll be ready for your own case. First, it's time to get out into the community and start building your reputation as a friendly protector or hardened authority figure. After that, you'll get to take a shot at finding and arresting a suspect. Get a move on, rookie. No one likes me, though. Oh man. I adore Stella, but maybe she was not the right choice for my initial gameplay. I thought that was something else. Um, Stella has discovered the suspect is a male. Suspect is wearing slacks. Oh, were there more? Uh, red hair. An adult. An adult male, red hair, wearing slacks. Did do they actually mean like slacks, or do they just mean like pants in general? Um, because I I'm not sure if there's actually a category of slacks in this game. That's a little. So, so is that a specific clothing item? I'm I'm not sure. <laughs> um, go on patrol. Yeah. Crime map. Okay. Now that I know what that is, go on patrol. Just, just do it. Just go do it. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> is this an empty lot? <laughs> uh, when an officer is on patrol, they can get to know the community and help keep troublemakers in check. Talk with residents to make a friendly or mean impression. If you see anyone littering or fighting, issue a citation to make sure they obey the law. This is... This... Where, where are we? Is this... Oh, this is Newcrest. Okay. Okay. Yeah, this is one of the neighborhoods in Newcrest. There's, like, never anyone here. Um, and I know that because I have a sim and another save that lives, like, right there. Like, right there. Are you littering? Do you have red hair? No, that is, that is blonde hair. I don't- I don't know. But it's blonde hair, but you are wearing slacks. Friendly introduction. Uh, he's already mad. He's already mad at me for being- being- Uh, why does everyone hate aliens? I- I'm- I'm honestly getting a little frustrated with this. Like... Why? Why are you people so angry? You even look angry. But you know what? I don't care. I am an upstanding citizen and protector of the law. I'm going to friendly all of you. And I don't even care- Stella? You're gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. I have to issue a citation. Sin. And Carolina's angry. Literally everyone I talk to is angry. I... You know, I, I really was not expecting this mechanic in the game. Um, feel a little... A little weird about that, not gonna lie. How about you? Are you doing anything? You, you littering? doing, like, literally anything. But you know what? I, I like to think of Stella as someone who's just really sweet and nice and is not about to... is not really about to 
fire up. What? No, no. Uh, let's just let's just move on. Mom patrol, making sure no one's littering. I thought that was litter. It's a butterfly. <laughs> Um, or fights. Maybe I should just like stay nearby, just in case. So everyone's kind of walking angrily right now, so maybe a fight will break out and then I can be there, I, I guess. <laughs> 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 no, no. Please. Offensive conversation. No, get 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 out of there. Ser seriously. Uh, uh, Issue a citation. Did you just- if this is here, does that mean you were littering? I'm kind of confused. Yeah, but no one- no one respects you when you're an alien. Yeah, this is just kind of sad. <laughs> um. Yeah, making me a little depressed. It's like, I, I didn't realize this game would make one of the supernatural races so despised, and I, I'm not entirely sure how to get around that, because I, I don't want her to be in disguise all the time. I want her to be, you know, herself. I don't know. I don't know exactly how to go around this. Um, you have possessed, processed enough clues to issue an all-points bulletin while you have a rough description of the suspect. The more clues you find and process, the more specific the description becomes. When you have a very detailed description of the perp, you'll be less likely to arrest an innocent who shares a few similarities with the guilty party. Hmm, okay. Issue all-points bulletin. Do I do that on the computer or the phone? Crime map. Okay. The map of crime. I'm gonna keep- I'm gonna call it that. The map of crime. That- that is its name now. I, I don't even care. That's, that's what I'm calling it from now on. <laughs> yes, we do want half walls. And we want them in dull mode. Um... Points bulletin. A suspect fitting the APB description has been spotted in this area. Ask around to see if anyone can point you toward the suspect. Use the notebook to review the suspect description before you make an arrest. If you arrest the wrong person, it won't look good on your record. Okay. Ask around to see if anyone can point you toward the suspect. I already read that, didn't I? Um. Hmm. See, we're looking for someone with red hair and slacks. And it's neither of you. Like, there's not probably not gonna be a lot of people at a bar lounge thing in like the middle of the day. It's not even noon yet. Um but you know, let's let's help let's ask our friendly bartender. Could even be your friendly bartender. I don't know if any of you have seen, um, uh, what's it called? I forgot the name of the movie, but it's, it involves. I just saw someone like that over there. I'm confused. I thought that they had red hair. Are they. I'm so confused. 
confused. Oh, it's you, isn't it? Of course you haven't, because it's probably you! Because, you know, red hair, slacks, male, adult. Where is this guy? Why aren't you answering me? Nice dancing, guys. Maybe you didn't give me any information. Uh, I'm really scared of like arresting the wrong person though. Can't help you. No, I'm trying to ask you about the suspect. Stop talking to that guy. Uh, yeah, it probably is. Oh man, did you leave? Yeah, it, it's probably you. So let's just go ahead and. So what did this guy do, anyway, at the library? Did he, like, steal stuff, or what exactly happened? Like, they were making it sound like he was in the room, but I, I wasn't sure if he was, like, what kind of- oh, Now that you've learned about work out in the world, you should know that there's plenty to do around the station, too. Run criminals through the booking station, take crime reports from civilians, and get to know your co-workers. You can also use the gym upstairs to stay fit, or browse the database on a computer to bolster your knowledge of the criminal mind. Cool. Oh yeah, shouldn't I be... Doing all this stuff. Or are they supposed to be doing that stuff? I'm not entirely sure at this point. Okay, cool. Very cool. Oh no, you're very hungry. Exercise, talk to the chief. I'm. I, I guess I'm just gonna lock you up. Like. <laughs> I'm not entirely sure what to do with you. I'm a little confused. I'm a little confused. And the alien thing is really not helping. Um. Let's get you something to eat from the vending machine. You are starving. Uh, sandwich. Is there a no no sense cap? Stays healthy. Ah, oh, thank goodness. Sound. Oh, and now you're dense. So you're thinking about the fire that almost killed you this morning. Almost murder you while you were eat making your eggs and toast. Yeah. Uh, maybe some exercise will cheer you up. Uh, practice punching, yeah. Punching is cool. Let's see what kind of... Oh, your outfit's adorable. I think I was trying to make her like a soccer player when I 
first set this up. And you know what? I'm gonna save real quick because I didn't even think of that. Um. And this is the Sleepy is Meringue, uh, one. Nope. That is too long. Uh. Hope the weird symbols don't mess up my game. Okay. Oh, yes, I do. Want to rogue right? Everything. <coughs> oh, I have quite a cough. Um, yeah. Let's look at you. Your cute little outfit. Yeah. Uh, when I first was designing the sim, I was definitely going for a very cute to see look. I thought that was just her thing. Look at her. Adorable. Very adorable. Um, ow, oh, my ears. Uh, I don't like my earbuds too much. Stay late, of course. Let's see, I guess I've already done that for an hour. Uh, browse police database. I think that's the logical next step. Don't you guys think? Oh man, are those people gonna report me for being an alien? <laughs> I saw them earlier. Um, uh, probably not gonna help with the whole tense thing, but... Well... What can you do, really? What can you do? See? She's totally happy. She's totally fine. 16 more hours to go. Search criminals at the booking station. Okay, I can... I can do that. I can totally do that. In fact, I'm gonna search this guy. This person. It's kind of intimidating. But no no-sense cat. Got a lot of gumption. <laughs> Go do the thing. Oh, stop being so tense. Not, not the red lady, but the Stella. <laughs> I guess you're not done. Oh, awkward turtle. Yeah, I get that. Totally get that. Okay. Mm. Lock and sell. Yeah, let's not just let her roam. And, uh, you need to use a restroom, so we'll just take care of that, and then I guess, I guess you're done for the day. Poor little alien. Intergalactic being. Let's give you some privacy. What's that? Mm. I'm just a little confused. What's the, the spyglass for? No idea. She did a fantastic job today. There may be shinier badge or and a new title in her future. We promoted to officer new clothes. Next shift is at Wednesday. It's Wednesday. All careers have a daily task to boost performance. 
Except for, uh, the professions, which are a little different from careers, so I guess it makes sense. Makes sense. Makes sense. Let's, uh, let's focus on making you happy. Oh, geez, are these from earlier? Let's just, uh, let's just ignore that. How do we bake something today? Put some sugar cookies. I mean, it won't really fill you up, but it might feel better. I know, I know, I love food. I love sugar cookies; they're delicious. When I was a kid, those were actually my favorite. I don't, I don't know what has to do with anything. What? Oh, oh no. <laughs> See, this is the, one of the little things I love. Is just how whimsical these games are, uh, generally. You go, you know, like little silly animations, and you know, I, I like that they keep kind of a realistic tone in some ways, because real people are clumsy too sometimes. And uh, yeah, that might glitch if I do that. Um, in a minute, I am totally going to update her stove <laughs> and make sure that it's not an awful, awfulness. Oh, you still have burn marks from earlier. Maybe we should clean that up before we get, like, ants or something. And, uh, yeah, grab some cookies. You you earned it. You earned it, honey. You still have no friends. Makes me kind of sad. Um, Alton seems to kind of like you. Uh, let's talk to him while you're eating. Oh, can you not do that? I'm a little confused. Uh, sometimes I forget exactly what multitasking things are available. Um, I think I can call them to like 10. So I guess that's it. I'm gonna have to deal with that amount of social. Uh, let's put these away. Did those actually go in? I think they did. Um, do do do. Yeah, let's do something fun before she goes to bed. So, let's make some video games. I know a lot of Sims really like video games. Like, literally no matter what personality they have, if you set them- it's, it's almost like a cheat, it feels like. If you just sit them down and have them play Sims Forever, they just- they just go crazy for it. They just- like, look at how quickly her- her happiness, a little fun bar filled up. Hey, look at that. That's that's actually a lot faster than the TV even. And uh, once she does that, we should probably just have her go to bed because we want to try getting up a little earlier to get her through the day tomorrow. <laughs> you know what? That's that's life. You know, it's just. You work, and you sleep, and you work some more, you sleep some more, sometimes you do both at the same time, you know? You, you work and you sleep. Uh, yeah, let's try to get you out of bed a little earlier. And uh, we'll go ahead and just have leftovers today, instead of trying to cook. I, I like to have them cook, like, uh, per meal, but... Uh, it's it's not gonna work out if um if she's just gonna be late because she she burns herself. Let's go ahead and just deal with that stove real quick. Oven stove. Two parts of the same thing really. Um, appliances, stoves. Get you just the damn most expensive stove. I like the yellow. There we go. No, I didn't mean to. There we go. And uh, it's probably a better fridge out there too. Yeah, yellow match. There we go. There we go. And uh. See, this is how it starts. Better replace that before I forget about it, though. Oh, 
And one of my earbuds just fell out. Let me just fix that. Oh no. Okay. Oh right, let's just... Yeah. Yeah, let's just have some leftovers. <laughs> I don't trust you. Oh, the salad. Yes. Mmm, yummy. Okay. See? You are happy today. You are so ridiculously happy. Let's just continue being happy with life, please. Uh, this is like the most unhappy sim I've ever had. Probably because her social need is hard to fill without her, you know, facing otherworldly predators. It's, it's very unfortunate. Yeah, let's just let you play video games until work. Or or chat online, apparently. <laughs> okay. Join for the work day. That'd be funny if I didn't, because then, you know, I I would literally just be at her house until she came back from work. Uh, that would be... that would just be silly. That would just be completely and utterly ridiculous. Um, okay. <clears throat> Keep trying not to cough into the mic. Get a case assignment. Uh, I already forgot how to do that. I think it's at the computer. Yes it is. Good, good. Wonderful. She kind of looks like a frog. Or is that like... Is that racist in this world? <laughs> I don't even know. Like, just why does everyone hate aliens so much? I... I, I don't understand it. I really don't. Um... Uh, let's do police... Browse the database real quick. Let's get some extra points going. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, start a case map. Yeah, why not? I mean, I, I don't know. Travel to crime scene. Uh, let's just yeah, let's just do what the the nice little instructions say. <laughs> there is never enough time in the day really to get everything done in the working world. Yeah. Hmm. Crime scene. At a crime scene, you can find clues that will help you track down a suspect. Investigate damaged or stolen objects and search for clues on the ground nearby to uncover more evidence. Also, talk with witnesses to get a report about what happened. Okay. Oh, I think this is a house I've been to before. This is a residential area, I believe. Based on the shower. <laughs> Crime scene photo. Collect clues at the crime scene. Okay, I guess I. What is that? What is that exactly? Like, I just. I have no idea. That's such a random piece of evidence. <laughs> um. Search for clues. Is that another of the exact same? Okay. Yeah, good. go ahead. <laughs> oh, oh, we're having some, some glitching issues. Uh, collect more clues at the crime scene. Oh, okay. 
take more crime scene pictures. I, I don't know why they just didn't give me multiple numbers of each, but okay. Um, take witness report. Let's go ahead and do that. Okay. Oh no, he's sad. <laughs> Um, let's see. Is there any other- oh, here's one. Uh, search for clues. No, it's Dina Caliente and Malcolm Landgrab. Oh, hey, where's the- where's the clue? Oh, I guess there isn't one in here. Uh, except for computers. I guess computers kind of just always have something. Okay, mm, more witness reports. I I guess I just kind of do that indefinitely for this one. <laughs> Hey, are you another alien, or are you just green? I think you're just green. Uh, yeah, it's just, okay. It's just keep getting, keep getting these. I mean, she is low on social, so it, it kind of only makes sense. Um, hmm. Collect more clues. What clues can I get? Computers seem pretty spot on. Is there a second floor to this? No, there isn't. Yeah. Anywhere else? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Search the hell out of those clues. There's like nothing there. It's like nothing there. Why? Why is there nothing there? <laughs> so I'm a little confused. Are those supposed to be like matches? Like that's, that's kind of morbid, don't you think? <laughs> Uh, some, some, some arson right there, if those are, those are matches, I mean, just, just saying. Well, I guess, like, I, I'm honestly curious, like, what is the extent of the crimes in this game going to be? Like, is it gonna go all the way to, like, murder? Like I, I, I wonder about that since it's it's been an implication in previous games that that has happened. Uh, like with the gold digging Sims and Sims Three, and yeah, there's all this evidence and no, no, no nothing. Okay, well I assume this will go back to the police station. Sad, there's already. Kind of late in her day, really. Uh, silly earbud piece. I'm just trying to fall out. Okay, cross reference the police dies. Gladly. Uh, let's use the crime witness reports. Yeah, so... I think Stella... I think Stella's a good employee. Staked. Um... To the crime map, gladly. 
It's very important that we add clues. Very important that those uh, clues are managed. Uh, the suspect is an elder. Huh. Deduce new clue. Curious what this does. Finally focused. Discover that she is female. Oh. Still has enough clues to issue an APB at the crime map. Collecting more clues before issuing an APB will increase her ability to find the suspect. Mm. Oh yeah, your day is about to end. Uh, even though it's way through schedule anyway. 8 a.m. to 7. Yeah, why is it saying they're already done? Um, I guess that's just the way the police career works. The nursing one is kind of the reverse. It's like you get in trouble for not doing like every little thing before you leave. Um, let's cross reference the database again and uh, let's see the photos this time. Yeah, you cross that reference data something. <laughs> Uh, and then browse the police database. I'm I'm assuming she's not like she's going home soon. Well, I guess just because this thing keeps telling me. Um, so I don't want to have her go inspecting stuff just yet. Analyze evidence. Evidence simple. Are you, oh. are, you, are you here to report something? No, I think you work here. I don't know why you're in civilian clothes. It's very confusing. Oh, goody. Man, I think that all the way to level 3. I didn't even notice that. Hmm. Failed to produce useful information. That's unfortunate. Um, discuss case theories with co-workers. Might as well, since her social is in the red. Um, hopefully no one is mad at her for supposedly hiding herself as an alien. Because, you know, that totally makes sense. <clears throat> and you've discovered that she's an alien too. And now you're mad, even though you were happy like literally five seconds ago i i i don't understand you people i really don't see you like her oh she, she's not trash she's not stop it please help her social job <laughs> Uh, okay. Oh, didn't that say six like, a second ago? Um. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're going home like in an hour. another day. And then I'm assuming I can just kind of pick up where I left off tomorrow anyway, so yeah, not, not a bad day's worth of work, I think. Um, yeah. It's like, there literally anything else I can do while I'm here for five seconds? Oh, you're so friendly. You make me proud. Swilla did a fantastic job today. There may be a shinier badge and new title in her future. Cool.
Granada. This place near where I live called Granada, actually. Oh, let's use this opportunity to... Oh, I love fish tacos. That's why I make them in The Sims. <laughs> Everything I enjoy eating, I end up making in The Sims, and then they eat it, and then I get hungry. Like, I was actually pretty full right before I started, but I'm kind of hungry again now. <laughs> um... Yeah, cookies, go. You eat that taco. I'm sure it's very delicious in your world. Do you think Stella misses food from her home planet? Because in her original bio from Sims 2, she had moved here from whatever the planet name is in Sims 2. And I mean, this is also an alternate universe, so... Is this Stella an alternate version of that Stella? Is this Stella the same version and she can cross through dimensions? Although I'm I'm assuming she's actually a different species entirely. It, ooh, dropped something. Uh based on the uh how do I put it? Uh based on the whole alternate universe thing and based on the specs of the aliens in uh Sims 2 versus, versus 3 and 4, like, they, they've all been very distinct from each other, I think. Uh, especially in, like, skin tone. I, I chose green for her on purpose, actually. In case anyone's, uh, wondering, I guess. <laughs> hmm. Very cute little alien. Very happy. <laughs> Sorry about that. Mike's a little... Fidgety. Yeah, no. No, I actually, I'm, I really enjoy this character. I think I'm pretty proud of her. Um, <laughs> even though she's based on one that already existed. I think it did a good job reimagining her. And, uh, it's probably why I enjoyed her so much. Man, it's only, no, you should, you should call one of your friends. Your social is so, so low. Or are they just mad when they discover you're an alien and forgive you? Because that would be nice. I would definitely be in support of that. Oh yes, the Simlish is strong with this one. Um, you're a co-worker, so I'm going to try to raise your... Yeah. And then... Yeah, I think that's what's good for tonight. I don't want to overwhelm her fellows. Ooh, I should do something fun before bed. There's not going to be any time to do it in the morning, that's for sure. Hey, game. It's forever. Forever and ever. See, so yeah, I'm not going to lie, I never did play Sims 1. And I'm... I'm not entirely sure if I would enjoy it, to be honest. Like it, I, I like playing things on easy. I'm not gonna lie. I like games that are simple and fun. And I mean, for me, The Sims, uh, the later renditions, uh, really were a good example of that. Um, but that doesn't mean I also don't enjoy things like Skyrim and Oblivion. And I tried to get into Morrowind. But it was a little too, too difficult for me, so, yeah, about that. <laughs> uh, but no, I, I just, I have my own play style, like, ooh, ooh, you're late for work? You're about to be late? You need to be showered and eating before you go. Uh. Oh no. I, I feel like this is me in the morning. <laughs> it's like anytime I have to go somewhere, it really does not work out this easily at all. Also I'm 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 just thinking like, is it weird when you can see your like 
go to the bathroom and stuff. Like, should I try to pan away? Oh, no, please put your clothes back on. There you go. Oh, that's another outfit I really like on her. Her fall outfit. Assuming she lives anywhere where there are seasons. I, I don't live somewhere where there's particularly seasons, uh, actually. Um, I am from the Bay Area in California, and therefore we don't really have seasons. <laughs> Uh, it's all just kind of one blur of cold. Uh, depending on how close to the bay you are, of course. Of course we are joining her. Um. Yeah, yeah, I started late today, so I owe you guys one more daily session. I believe. So yeah. So, just a heads up, we're gonna go through one more day at work for her, and uh, we're rounding down to the 11 o'clock cutoff time, so uh, we are going to be done very soon. I have to bid you all adieu, uh, but not yet. <laughs> not quite yet. Uh, I have clues to the crime map. Of course we're gonna add clues to the crime map. Are you kidding me? It's amazing. Love that crime map. Suspect is wearing a jacket. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do the APB. Hmm. Well, it didn't invite me to do that, so... Let's do this instead. Crime scene photo. Do it. No, it's this. No, it's this. Oh, yeah, don't press the web. Do your job. <laughs> uh, why does that look like DOS to me? I. Anytime it's like the black with like faint stuff on it, I, I assume DOS. I, I know a little bit about DOS. Uh, that was probably a little surprising. Um. When I was like eight, my dad sat me down and taught me how to install it on a computer. I'm not saying I actually remember how to do anything useful like that. Right here. That was an elder, that makes sense. Um, but... Yeah, let's just go ahead and do this. Yeah. But, uh... Yeah, no, I actually, I had the opportunity to be a lot more techie than I am today. <laughs> um, fortunately, I did not grab that opportunity by the horns. I mean, I was like eight, so not like I'm going to remember all that stuff very well. <laughs> like, you ever notice when you're remembering, like when anyone remembers a memory of you as a child, it's just, it's always the same age, like no matter what think about these things. Okay. Somewhere around here- oh, this park is bigger. Oh, this park is huge. How am I supposed to find anyone? Complaining. <laughs> um, I'm looking for an elderly- oh, I'm not even sure if it's a woman or not. An elder wearing a jacket with gray hair. In fact, is it you? How about to talk to one of them right now? I wouldn't be surprised. You're wearing a jacket, and your hair doesn't look all that shiny, and you might be an elder. Just go out suspect. This <laughs> Shine. Alfonso Mapim? Yes. Uh -huh. Green a proper uh -huh. I haven't seen anyone like that. So it's cute. He might be that woman right there. I'm really paranoid about catching the wrong person now. So very paranoid. No, no, I'm not. Ask about suspect, please. Oh. 
is it? It might be her, but it's kind of hard to tell if her hair is gray or black. I I can't even tell if she's an elder or not. <laughs> Frankly, um, kind of difficult to tell in this game. I I think that's her though. Especially when they say, "Oh, we've never seen anyone like that," even though that's totally their their description. Ah, uh, screw it. Yeah, let's, let's see what happens. Hmm, this is kind of creepy. Um, the whole, hey, who locked me in? Or let me in? Who locked the door? It's like, please. Hmm, okay. I'm gonna go ahead and lock you away. Ooh, I can interrogate her actually. Let's do that. Let's interrogate. Let's do that. That sounds that sounds fun. Amuki Gaba? Amuki Gaba indeed. Man, I just- I love the layout of this place. Like, it's- I don't know, just- it just appeals to me. It's cool. Interrogate the suspect. So I guess I just keep doing this until- I'm done. Um, oh. Okay, Hanra. Uh, I'm gonna focus on evidence. Show fingerprint evidence. Okay, Fupa. Anabash. Wode. Lanchi Croya. El Fonsa. Show great pictures. What did she even do? Like, I, I guess they just kind of keep it vague on purpose. Show witness statement. Okay, Fupa. Anabash. Wode. Lanchi Croya. El Fonsa. Tufka. I about to get a confession out of you. Uh, reveal calling card. Good cop, bad cop. Uh, discuss victim. Like, am I supposed to wait for her to, to crack? I. Oh, okay. I'm almost there. Good, good. Ask about crime. Oh, jeez, did it go down? Defensive. Like, can I replay the evidence, or would that be... Show crime pictures. I didn't do anything. Oh, oh, innocent. Oh no, I got the wrong person. Oh, oh this is embarrassing. I mean, is that just something that happens sometimes? I, I, I don't know. Take a mugshot. Walk a room crab. 
Why do any of these things use the bathroom? I, I think about these things. And why aren't you... Uh, go take a mug shot of that guy. Come on. Stop being glitchy. Take my shot. Well, no. But yeah, no, I bet. I bet everyone's super mad at her. She's catching the wrong lady. And that's, uh, that's unfortunate. Oh, no. I apologize if that hurt anyone's ears. Very much so. We don't exactly have a great setup for my mic at the moment. So, uh, yeah. Oh, we took the mugshot. There we go. Uh, target the, well, I already have targeted the suspect. I don't, I don't know what you people want from me. Uh, let's, let's lock you back up. Yes, I get it. I'm an alien. I get it. Well, oh, she's an alien. I am not my son. I have a son who kind of looks like me. Not actually, not, not intentionally based on me, but happens to look like me. After this, I guess we'll have her take a little lunch break. Sandwich, as usual. As per her usual. Okay, you were still using the bathroom when I went back down to you. That was not intentional. So you have a little lunch, and then- oh no! So your work is about to end very soon. Ugh, wasted all that time. A suspect that wasn't even real. That's unfortunate. Okay, whenever you're done with that, let's just go ahead and uh, leave your computers. Not really, but uh, cross-reference police database. Crime witness report. Yesterday we we'll ended an hour. Quit eating. Let's go. Don't have time for food. Besides, do aliens even really need food? That was a weird time glitch. <gasps> you did a fantastic job again. Just barely. <laughs> yeah, it's seven. End of shift. Stella did a fantastic job today. There may be a shinier badge and a new title in her future. Yes. I am quite the perfectionist. Okay, well, I guess since it is 11.05, um... Yeah, let's circle this plume bob here. Uh, you know, really thank, thank you, all of you, who stuck around to the end. Um, you know, I know things just started. Probably not that entertaining yet. <laughs> um, but thank you, all of you who stuck around. You know, uh, it means a lot having the support of the people who do watch. I, I actually, I'm not even sure if anyone was watching. I'm just, just in case. Um, you know, it means a lot that I have been having support though. From people maybe who don't really have the time to watch or whatever, but who have been trying. Hey, hey, you will play Sims and that is all you will play. Hear me? Uh, yes, because I like how meta this is. Um, okay, so, I don't really know how to do outros yet, so, but thank you again, uh, for joining me for Sleepy Is Marie. My name is Pokladots, and, you know, I think it's time for us to go. I probably should have thought of that.
before saving. Let's just save real quick. <laughs> um, so yeah, so sorry for the late start, everyone. Um, we were having a little bit of some last minute stuff. Difficulties where we're like, we're not entirely sure how we got things to start working. Um, I am going to pause and alt tab so I make sure that the stream ends. Um, so, all of you, thank you again for joining me for Sleepies and Rain. I am Pokelinots, and I will see you Monday through Friday night on Twitch and every day on.